And I'm back. It's time for the next trailer now. January is ratcheting up. The Japanese game industry is like, oh, y'all thought we wasn't making motherfucking video games, bitch. Well, now we got too many because now the end of January, we got Monster Hunter, Dissidia, and Dragon Ball Fighter Z. And I'm not going to get one. I'm not going to get two. I'm going to get all three of them bitches. And we're going to go in. So let's check out this Dissidia trailer. I love this game on the PSP. I played it so much. Leveled up all the characters, got to the story. I even played the sequel, which I didn't think was as good. I know it should be better. There's just something about it that I didn't like as much as the first. I don't know why, maybe I'm crazy, but I've wanted one of these games on a proper next-gen console for so long. It's finally happening. The three on three is a bit weird. The beta was a bit weird, but it doesn't diminish my excitement. I'm very excited to go in here, play with my friends. Like I said in the Dragon Ball trailer, if you're looking for people to play with and you don't have a big group, Fight Club down below, it's going to be live and popping, and we're all pretty casual. We like to have a good time. Let's just get down to this trailer and see what Square has done for us with Dissidia. D team partial nudity. Ooh, Koi Tecmo, Team Ninja, Neo, potential game of the year. Let's see what we got. It was once plagued by divine conflict. English. But saviors from beyond were able to stem that eternal blight. And yet... Poppin! was finished. We have been called upon to serve a new purpose. By Cosmos? No, by the heiress of her will. We were, but the reasons for our assemblage are twofold. Hmm? Our memories are the catalyst by which the world expands. And the energy obtained from our clashes maintains it. Materia didn't seem to know too much about us. She didn't even seem to know too much about her world, come to think of it. Nor did the two gods seem to know each other. Maybe Spiritus isn't our enemy after we all. We got story mode? So, uh, I'm glad you didn't forget about me. I did. For a bit. Damn. You're going after them, aren't you? That's where you're headed. Whatever. Mm -hmm. Um, hold up. You don't have to go all the way back there. Trust me, you'll like it. Ah! What did you do? Eventually, our goals will align. I better be able to switch it over to Japanese immediately. What is... Our little squabble has awakened the beast. Come. Let us quit this place. The gate. At this juncture, that the power of Super Nintendo infesting the world. We just let the world get consumed. I also want to make sure that Terra. Without this world, we couldn't see each other anymore. Two arms, then. <laughs> if only. Some things are guzzling down our energy for themselves. The same ones that were doing it before. They suck on the force we seek to amass. Our paths home are blocked as long as it draws breath. The man Odin? Deserves a quick death. Save your quarrels and posturing for another time, Materia. Did you know of this, Spiritus? Okay, show us some gameplay. We all know what it plays like. Let's turn the videos out there, this. I'm talking about. Woo! Yo, hype! Blitzball hype. I love Blitzball. If y'all don't like Blitzball, Omni Slash hype. Oh yeah, I'm ready. I'm ready, just play it. I just want to play it. Oh my god, these games and the release dates. Someone stop it, please. Uh yeah, that game is gonna be good. I really hope they keep I don't know much about the modes of the console version. I know they added a lot more to it because they understood that you can't just port an arcade version to the console and keep it bare bones. You gotta have 
story mode, you gotta have extras, arcade mode. Look what happened to Street Fighter V, it got eaten alive because it didn't have the content there to keep people satisfied. I just wonder if they're gonna keep all the stuff I liked about the old games. Like I loved building up the characters from level one, getting all the different skills, equipping them, different moves. I just hope that the change of three on three doesn't diminish the individual character progression because you always have to fight in a major group like that. And uh, I kind of hope that you can just invite a friend, play against the CPU, level up, have fun like that. So what I'm, I don't know. They haven't really talked too much about it unless I'm missing something, but it looks really cool. I'm very excited to play it. I like the story mode. The dub, as always, is a little rough. Sometimes the American voice actors, and I'm not saying all American voice actors in all things, because the Dragon Ball Z American voice actors fucking get it in. When they need to yell, scream, and shout, you feel that shit. But in some of these RPGs, like they just play the character so flat. And if you switch over to Japanese, they have so much passion and rage. And, you know, you listen to the American one, and it's like, oh, no, please. Why'd you kill my family? It's just like they told them to whisper scream or some shit like that. I don't know. But not, my name is Namtox. I can't even say my own name. Holy crap. If you enjoyed this reaction, hit the like, comment, and subscribe. And uh, I don't know. I'll see you guys on the other side of the new year with some fighting game mayhem. Thanks for watching, everybody. Peace out.